Morning, this is Burn Wright, and thank you for joining me for Europa Universalis for Russian Campaign, where we have again and again beat ourselves against Europe and lost. But are now are slowly spreading east and south and north, but not yet west. So, what we're going to do is attack Norway with... Because this just rebelled... So we're going to attack Norway with our mercenary army to help preserve manpower. And I have a mission that's going to complete in a moment as well. Hooray, national unrest and tax modifier. That is nice. So let's see what other missions. Accumulate money. Have at least 400. So after the war, and I gain prestige, I'll do that one. So after the war, I can just turn off military maintenance and have that in no time. So let's see here. Um, so everything I'm doing. Diplomatic reputations. Okay. Still Eastern. Just gotta get out of that. I need to attack the Commonwealth now. What a pain. I guess I didn't lean on them enough in the beginning and then... So let's attack Norway. You have no friends. Fur, good as news. Fur is produced in Ekaterinburg. Et Et cool. 700 more settlers, and I can just continue to push. Tell us the end of religious turmoil. Excellent. Oh, there's their military. Let's see if they'll come attack me. Oh, they're going up there. Are they going to move down? We now control this province. Are they going to try and siege? Interesting. I can take all of their provinces over here before they even finish that. They're just going to be suffering attrition. Got that taken care of, and they won't be able to reinforce it all, which is nice. So I can upgrade my military again. So I'll just hold off on that until after the war, because I don't want to change my infantry right in the middle. Oh, they built a fort down here. So that'll take a little while. I don't have any cannons with me or anything, but that's fine. It's going pretty fast. Oh no, vassal! Don't get killed. Poor government policies. Lose the stability or lose money. I'll lose money. How come this is at 0% still? There's something wrong. Annex products. Diplomatic reputation minus 3. So. I'm just wasting my time there. I have to get my diplomatic rotation fixed. So that's nice. They surrendered that. Can I get it through Sweden here and just grab this for a little more war score? Ask for military access. Thank you very much. The siege lasted 223 days. Oh, Great Britain joined. I didn't even pay attention to that. I should have because that's kind of a wasteful use of uh, provincial unrest, independence for Norway. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. OK. 
Okay, let's just go crush this, and then we'll have all the war score we can want. Oh no! I don't have a leader, and there's super crossing penalties. That was close. Peace offer from Norway. Okay, so speed 5 is really fast. It's not really the best to do while you're at war. So let's see what they will do. Sue for peace. Could take more provinces. Take money. That's a lot of money. Oh, they could become a vassal. And then I could just annex them. That's nice. War reparations. Russian vassal. And let's see. Suffer aggressive expansion, whatever. We have 200 ducats, which will complete my mission. And I'll have the vassal of Norway. Which I can annex in 10 years, so I won't have to go out to the sea to conquer them. Although that would be pretty easy. I don't really feel like building the ships. I think it'll prevent anyone else from attacking Norway also if they're my vassal. Yes, why not? No, they said no. It's because of the money? Oh. Because I need to go out there and take that stuff. Okay, so I'll just do war operations. 200 ducats. And co three coastal provinces, which will give me some aggressive expansion and overextension. I think I can handle that pretty easily. There's a lot of unrest up here, though. But I need to do something. Let's do it. Hooray! Gain 10 prestige. Get a new mission. Convert Sog to Orthodox. What do I get? Missionary Strength plus one. Ten months. Okay, I'll do that. I'll take that mission. And let's core you. Core you. Only took three, right? That's correct. missionaries are sent there, so I'm going to have to deal with rebels for a while, probably. Alright, so I'll upgrade my military tech. Which is excellent. And now I can get offensive eastern musketeers or defensive eastern musketeers. Since I'm attacking so much. Huh. I'll stick with offensive. Let's see what m the opinion map mode is of me right now. Commonwealth hates me, as does Kazan. Everyone else is kind of yellowish. They like me, they're my vassal. Lots of provincial unrest. Where is it? Protestant zealots in Sagan. Let's move over. Use my mercenaries to crush those rebellions. And Great Britain's hanging out there. They're black flag, though. That's a pain. They need to ship themselves back. That'd be cool if they were just hanging out there and they could help us crush rebellions. But they can't. But I have mercenaries. So let's see where my military is. I have that. I have that. 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 That is part of this army and that's guarding against any kind of rebellion in the colony. Let's kick it back up to speed 5. Let me look at my diplomatic. Is that me? 
Diplomatic reputation. Legitimacy, overextension, and annexed subjects. Just have to wait for that to go away. Great Britain, I have an alliance. I don't have, so let me cancel this military access with Sweden. And let's see if I can get a nice royal marriage with Great Britain. For happiness and legitimacy reasons. And then I have one more diplomatic relation, which I was looking at before, that I could use to get another ally. I really want someone to help me fight the Commonwealth. Who does, who does not like the Commonwealth? The Ottomans hate them. I wonder if I could become their ally and fight the Commonwealth with them. So they're allied to Kazan. They're a different religion. And we're not that strong a military or navy compared to them. Well, let's start improving relations. Maybe we can eventually get there one day. I'm gonna stop atta attacking Kazan. Let's see what happens. Be a nice ally to have. How's this conversion going? Ten months is pretty fast. Military access from Brandenburg, sure. You guys can go fight, throw your troops away, weaken everyone. We have converted them, hooray! Missionary strength plus one. Rebel uprising. Yep, down here is super unhappy. Let's, oops, let's just split you in half and you can reinforce each other. Hopefully you won't lose against a rebel uprising. Get the defensive bonus. And I need my missions again. Prove legitimacy. Have it a hundred. Diplomatic reputations. So improved religion legitimacy for improved legitimacy. No, thank you. I'm going to leave that out for now. Um, well, this has been going on for a while. I don't know. Is it time to take a break? Not yet. I'll take a few more minutes. She So much unrest everywhere. Do I have friendly troops here yet? Yeah, it's not helping very much. Gain Patriarch Authority or Admin Power. I will gain Patriarch Authority. I love it. Naval Force Limit plus two. Hooray! Alright, you two there. That's one. Click to build in Neva. Okay, it's weird. Mouse got messed up. And now my military can get 14 more. So what do you guys have? You have one cannon, one cavalry, so I want three cannons, three cavalry, and that will leave me with eight, so I can get eight infantry. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, three, one, two, three. All right, my next army. I feel like I'm finally expanding to the point where, I don't know. Ah, uh, tech. Neighbor bonus. I will do this. All right, how's all this coring going? It's taken a while. Four hundred military power. I can get an idea, and I am twelve, so fort reinforced speed, land attrition. That's what I really want it for. And that, of course, that. Uh, I'll work up this one. 
Yearly armature should plus five. That'll be nice too. Let's see what I can build as far as buildings go. I think I need to wait for these to core. So barracks, barracks, barracks. Okay, they're dealing with that. I was going to build more mercenaries, but I forgot. Um, I will build a couple more barracks. Or five, I guess. Full maintenance. They may have crossing penalty there and penalty there, so... Oof. That's, uh... Not going too well. Won that one. Should win this one. Felt hats. I might win this one. Oh, I lost. I knew I should have. Uh, now I'm going to get the penalty here, but whatever. I think the morale is low enough. But even with those penalties, I should be okay. Alright, so now where do I have unrest? Just in Soga. And you're heading really far away. Where are you going? Wow. Okay then. That was interesting. <laughs> and I have my other army here. Let me grab all these guys. I do want a couple more infantry in here, I think, to complete it. Yeah, two more. That's good, though. I still don't have leaders. Um, probably going to turn down my army maintenance. Unless I do go to war with the Golden Horde. That could be fun. How's the Ottomans looking? Do a royal marriage yet? No. Diplomatic reputation. My opinion is improving. So, maybe one day, and then I can use them to fight the Commonwealth. That would be wonderful. Oh well. Well, this is a good time to take a break. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next episode where Russia continues to expand. I'm doing okay. I think I could defend myself against anyone, but I don't think I could attack the Commonwealth yet, which I really want to. Really want to. And I'm making colonies. Super fun. Alright, thanks for joining me. I'll see you in the next video.